Hello, and welcome to a Tuesday edition of Robert vs. the New York Times Crossword. Today we're going to do the Tuesday, May 2nd, 2023 crosswords, and go for that 1159 day streak. So here is your spoiler alert for the Tuesday Mini. If you'd like to play along, pause the video here, click on the link in the description below. The Mini is always free to play. Alright, let's do it. Soy? Maybe it's Oat and Obama. Aesop? Trey? Uh, Clef? I know I have an error down here. Flap. All right. It was Oat and Obama. Lease Elmo Flap. Nice. Okay. No, no theme that I can see. Anyway, now for the main event. That's the Tuesday Daily Grid, which is by Amy Lucido today. Here is your spoiler alert. If you'd like to play along, pause the video here. Click on the link in the description below. The Daily Grid does require a New York Times game subscription. I see these circled squares going across. Let's see what uh, Amy Lucido has in store for us. Let's get into it. Destination for Perseverance, Mars, it's Madams, Full of Love, Amorous. These are rom-coms, and this is Ski. This is a dominatrix, I think. Red Sox or White Sox. Certain status on social media, Enrico Fermi. This is Ultimate, shout out to Stickers. This is Cuffs, I guess. Lady Gaga, this could be Guava. Guarded with respect. At least you did your best. And this is an answer. Udon. Shout out to Minjin. This famous Amos. This is Avid. Admired. Decorate colorfully in a way. This is an Ada. Result of, a, of burnout. Maybe Ash. This could be a hut. Completely. These are mini marts. Tremini. Get it. Boy C. So it looks like they might be pound. Sorry. Anagrams. A great color flame away. Tie dye. This is Edsel. Pond build up with algae. I don't give a damn. Weathered as a storm and posing surface. Okay, guess it's not catwalk. This is Sid. Yoga mat, I see. This is a star. These are ats. Cordon could be tape. Uh, Dua Lipa. Interesting. I don't know this British author. Zoom button you might click when your dog barks. I guess it's mute. This is DMs or IMs? Not sure. Uh, Birch relative and practice boxing is spar. Can't type today. Mozzarella and cream cheese often served as an appetizer. Slightly better. Okay. Character associated with the beverage shaken. I see this is James Bond. Shaken, not stirred. A main DNA friend anime Alero. This is Thomas Nast. These are Mo Moogs, I think they're pronounced. Sumatra. Stick around remain. Tallest peak in the Cascades. Recording device. I guess it's a cam. Today school is ASU. Shelter by the beach is a cabana. Meme that moves is a GIF. Opera's Barber of Seville. No idea. Earl Stanley Garter though. This is Angie. An Alder? Mm, iPad, I see. Tree like member. This is Groot. Tiny Arachnid is a Mite. Man with a code. This is MGM. Morse code. They might be full of beans. Burritos. Uh, so I need an R here. Martin Amos. Figaro. Grim. Error. Mount Rainier. Uh, ride out. In Toto. Road out. Allah. Alright. Got a Bond themed puzzle. One of my favorite puzzles of 2020 was a 007 Bond themed puzzle. But uh, maybe I should have been able to see these anagrams happening. Got a bunch of interesting shaken, not stirred, martinis. Dominatrix, mini marts, Mount Rainier, spelled like this, and Martin Amos. That's very interesting. I'm sure there's a way to do anagram searches in one look. Should I try to figure it out on the fly? That's another question. Anagram. 
Uh, anagram on one look. How do I do this? Oh, I can use new traumatic also. Can I can I look for? I've used this before because of uh, Murray Unicorn. Angle brackets. And can I use stars? <laughs> can I do this? Surely. Can't parse that. Note warnings. Huh. Okay, I'll try one more time just to see what happens. Apparently, I'm doing something wrong. All right, well, I'll, uh, wait, what is this, C star? I guess the problem is I don't know reg X. Oh, I see, that's constant. <laughs> All right, well, I tried. <laughs> I tried, but uh, I'm, I guess I'm not going to be able to do it. Let's, uh, let's take a look through this puzzle. See if we can learn something. Got old will be old arrows. It's getting kind of old in these puzzles. We've got famous Amos and Martin Amos. It's interesting, I think. Yeah, I remember someone in my comment section said that this is pronounced Moog. So I said Moogs today. I'm quite proud of myself. You know, I thought this puzzle was slightly hard in the fill for a Tuesday. Not super hard. Luckily I knew this piece of crossword ease. Just slightly hard. It's not so bad though. Also got amorous rom-coms. It's kind of a fun side by side there. Yeah, shout out to stickers who both love playing ultimate. Stickers, you should comment below if you want me to to play ultimate with you this next season. I'm still coming back for my I like, to, I like to tell people I'm still coming back from my foot injury. We've got burritos and burrata also. I mean, quite different, but somehow they're similar as uh, sequences of letters anyway. Yeah, I think this is slightly hard for a Tuesday, but well within the normal range. Um, and a nice nice collection of of martini anagrams. Should I try it? Will, will, will one look anagram stuff like this? It doesn't appear that it will. Oh, it just ignored my angle brackets. <laughs> All right, I tried. If you know how to search anagrams on one look, let me know in the comments down below. Um, it will be, like I said, maybe slightly hard, but not unusual for a Tuesday. Let's, uh, let's next do the plus word. Oh, whoops, I still have Momo here. Here's your spoiler alert for the plus word. If you'd like to play along, pause the video here, click on the link in the description below. And the plus word is free to play. British mini crossword meets Wordle. Serpent and loose garment. It's gotta be snake, right? This is Naker. Palette is Ashen. This is the Koran. This is an enemy. It's a Mason, so smock, I guess. And just rocks, perhaps? Just rocks. 20 second plus word. It's, uh, if you've been watching for any length of time, that's pretty quick for me. We've got two anagrams today, that's very British. Strawberries and cream, that's very British. Kenny Rogers, pretty sure he's American. Yeah, you can spell Quran this way. Yeah, nice little plus word. Happy to have a 20 second plus word on the books. Last thing we do before we go, is take a look at the mini leaderboard for tomorrow, where it looks like you're all enjoying your Tuesday evenings, Monday evenings. Hope, hope that's the case. And on the old secret leaderboard, nobody yet. Anyway. Thanks for watching, thanks for liking, commenting, and subscribing, and I'll see you tomorrow for some Wednesday puzzles. See you then.